Hello, this is John Ronsley, Independent Affiliate for Freebay. And today, what I'm going to go through is G999 Wallet Encryption. So first off, um, locate where you downloaded, where the download file for G999 was. For me, it's in Downloads, and it's the one that I extracted. So I've opened that up. And to make things easier for me going forward, what I'm actually going to do is just copy out the G99-QT file onto my desktop so I know where to hit it in future just to start my G999 wallet up. So double click the G999 icon and that will start the wallet up. Once in the wallet, it will take time to sync again, as we know. And um, this was 19 hours ago since I was last on it, so it's taken 19 hours. But once you're there, go up to settings. And if you go to settings, you'll see encrypt wallet. Go into encrypt wallet. Now put a new passphrase in there. Now remember what it says there. It's 10 or more random characters. Um, or 8 or more words in order to make your own passphrase or seed if you like. So I'm going to put a passphrase in here now. So once you've put your first passphrase in, click just to the right of where it says repeat your passphrase and put your repeat what you've just created as a passphrase. Once that's done, press OK, and you will get a warning that if you lose that seed, then you will lose all of your G999. So it's so important to remember that seed or that passphrase. You must remember that. So click OK again. This will now bring up another warning saying that actually, um, just having it encrypted doesn't protect you against malware. Malware could potentially still be downloaded on your computer and get access to the wallet. So once you say that's OK, again, don't shut down the computer until the icon goes and that's it. So once again, thanks for listening and good luck going forward. Thank you.